Hi everybody, my name is Ian Lamont. I'm the author of Google Drive and Docs in 30 Minutes, which also covers Google Sheets. And today I'm going to show you how to export a PDF from Google Sheets. This will be the same in Windows or Mac or a Chromebook. As long as you can open Google Sheets in a browser, this happens to be a Chrome browser, uh, you'll be able to do what I'm about to show you. So open up your, your Sheets, go to File, Download, PDF Document. Okay. One thing I want to note, when I set up the sheet, it was a little bit weird because there's all these extra columns to the right which don't have any information in them. And, and Google Sheets is trying to print everything. So you can see everything will be really super tiny because it's fitting it to width. So one thing that you can do is you can, you can, um, you can change the way that, the, that it will be printed. So I could change it, for instance, to a portrait, which will be longer. But I'm gonna keep it in a landscape but what I am going to change is the custom page breaks. So uh, you can edit them. Basically, Google Sheets found out automatically where the page break should be, like all the stuff that I want on the left, all the stuff that I don't want on the right. And it will create a new page for each one of these other sections. So I'm going to confirm the breaks. Let's do that again. Slide it over here. Confirm the breaks. OK, now I'm going to export it. Downloading PDF. I'm going to save it to my downloads folder and let's uh, open it up and see what it looks like. All right, so here's the PDF. Um, you can see that it gathers all the information on the first page and then those other junky pages uh, that didn't have any information on them, those other columns. Um, when I print it out, I can just not include those particular pages. For more information on how to get the most out of Google Sheets, Google Docs, Google Drive, check out my book, Google Drive and Docs in 30 Minutes, available from in30minutes.com. My name is Ian Lamont. I'm the author and the publisher. Thank you so much for watching.